Hey guys, I wanted to share what I got my kids for Christmas. So in this video, I am going to be sharing what I got my eight-year-old son. Um, my husband and I just laid everything out and we're comparing and it looked like he did not have enough. So we had, <laughs> we had to shift some stuff, but I think it's all good. His stuff actually cost more. So that was part of it. I try to shop used um, when I can and... I think only one of his items and two of his items were used. Whereas my daughter's, I was able to get a lot more of hers used and on clearance. So anyway, it is what it is. They don't really compare too much, so we should be fine. I will show you first. Santa always brings one combined gift for both of them. And this year, this is what he um, is bringing. This um, Sharper Image laser tag set. It has enough for four people to play. And they, um, at the park playground one day, there was some kids that had one of these and they played with them and they had so much fun. So that will be for both of them. All right. So I got each of my kids a logic game this year. This one you can see I got used. I need to take the price sticker off. I'll do that later. Um, but this is Codemaster, a programming logic game. I thought it looked like a lot of fun and something that my son would enjoy. So I got that. He's also been very into making stop motion movies lately. So I got him this little set from Amazon. It comes with two little, I forget what these guys are called, two little figures, the thing here to make like the background and then a little um, kind of like tripod. Um, to hold it up but there's like two of these figures and a little tripod and these here to build this like little kind of background so I think he will be very excited about that um, this is one thing that was going to be for both of them, but we're now just giving to him. They are these magnetic building blocks or building cubes. And my kids play with like little figures, Minecraft figures, army men, that kind of stuff all the time. And they also still play a lot with their magnetiles. So I thought these would just be something fun to add in there. Actually really pricey. Um, but there you can kind of see the size of them. So he's getting two sets of those. I may take them out of here and put them in a storage container. I'm not sure yet, but he's getting those. I got those on Amazon. Um, he's getting some Legos. He's getting two minifig blind bags. And then this was one that was on his wish list that he really wanted. He really likes um, bees, like honeybees. So we got him this one. And let's see. This I picked up at the thrift store, but it's, um, from what I can tell, brand new. And my husband checked and made sure all the pieces were in here. Um, but it's just this crazy contraptions Lego set. I think he'll enjoy that. He really likes Legos. I also got uh, both the kids one of these little um, cases for their Switch games. Um, we have a Nintendo Switch, but they, a family member is getting them each their own Switch lights this year for Christmas. And so I thought it was important that they each have their own little game case. So I got this and then um, I got some games used at a consignment sale. And so he is getting um, the, this Lego, can't read that, Lego Worlds, and then Mario and Rabbids. So that's what's in his case. And he is also very much into the periodic table. And so I always try to get my kids something based on their interests. So I got him this game, uh, Periodic, a game of the elements. They had a really good uh, Black Friday deal on this. Um, but I actually got mine from eBay, it's still brand new. And I think I saved a couple dollars off the Black Friday price, but I could have just waited and gotten it on um, Black Friday. But hopefully he'll like that. 
And then I got a couple books to go with it. I got this DK um, Elements book and this, The Element in the Room. I saw this on Airhouse Reads channel. And I think he is going to love this. He totally geeks out over anything periodic table. So I think that this is going to be a great little gift for him. And then the last thing that I have for him, um, last year I got my daughter a big bag of Minecraft figures from a consignment sale and I put it in a little storage bin for her for Christmas. And he wasn't really into Minecraft at the time, but now he is. And so he said, Mom, I want a big container of Minecraft figures like you got Ava. Well, I looked and looked and looked <laughs> secondhand and at consignment sales and I couldn't really find anything. So, and Minecraft figures are expensive. So here's what I did. I've got a storage container. I got these two little figures off our local free board. Someone was giving these away. So I've got two animals. And then I got four um, figures from Five Below. These were each $5. So I've got those in there. And then I got a pack um, of these like little blind bag minifigs from eBay. They're all new. And I think there were two, four, six, five. there were nine originally in the pack. I gave the kids each one for something else. So the rest are in there for him. So once he opens all of this, then he has a storage container um, to put it in. So um, I think he'll be excited about that. So that's um, something he's been asking for and I think he'll really like. So that's everything that I got my eight-year-old for Christmas. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know down below.